What's up Gadgeteers, my name is Hector and this is Gadget Beard and on this channel I unbox and review everyday tech, gadgets and accessories for you. Now in today's video we have the sub case case lineup for the iPhone 11 Pro Max. Now that these are the models you're currently seeing here in front of you uh, but they do have these for the iPhone 11 and the iPhone 11 Pro as well so it doesn't matter what model you picked up you can get all three of these cases for your model so without further ado let's go ahead and start with the first one so this is the sub case unicorn beetle style case now this one will run you $12.99 with prime shipping on Amazon. Links to all three of these cases will be in the description below. So this is the style, this is $12.99. This is the Electro, the Unicorn Beetle Electro. This one's gonna run you $16.99. And this is the Subcase Unicorn Beetle Pro. This one's gonna run you $19.54. As I mentioned earlier, all these have prime shipping. Links to all three of these cases will be in the description below. So. I just wanted to give you that quick rundown, the prices, the styles they are, and I'm just gonna take my iPhone, I'm gonna show you how the iPhone looks on the case, and then see if it wirelessly charges, and to see if it affects anything on the iPhone, probably not. Just make sure all the ports and, and cutouts are aligned perfectly and precise. So, without further ado, let's go ahead and start with the first one. This is the Unicorn Beetle style here. Now, this is offered in different colors. I got the black one here, and then they do have an all clear one here as well. So, let's just go ahead and put that to the side. We get the iPhone here. Now, this is probably the slimmest of them all. You do have a rubbery texture TPU here along the edges of the case with a hard plastic shell on the back. Now, it is cleared outlined by an accent color. This one right here is black with gray. So, all your Raider fans right there, bling blouse. This is the case you want. Bam. But overall, looks pretty good. It's a nice looking case, very slim and minimal. And you do have a little bit of sub case. Let's see if we can get that branding there at the bottom of the case. Let's go ahead and enter the phone. Now we have the phone inside the case. Oh, look at that, look at that. And it looks very, very pretty, nice and snug. This case ain't going anywhere. It's not flying out of the phone. The phone's not gonna fly out of the case if it falls. Now we do have some lip protection right there, some lay on the table design. Not too much, but we do have some. And I do have a screen protector currently on and it is the Y-Stone dome screen protector and it does not interfere with the screen protector whatsoever. And I don't think it'll interfere with any screen protector because it does stay pretty much close to the edges here of the phone and not the glass. So it looks very good. And I think this case is gonna be very, very screen protector friendly, but it does not add too much bulk. It looks very, very good. The buttons are covered, but they are easily accessible, nice and tactile, very clicky, and you do get a very satisfying feeling when pressing down on the buttons. The mute slider there is easily accessible. Boom, nothing to it right there. And on the side, the power button is also covered, but it is very nice and responsive, very tactile, and you do get that same satisfying feeling when pressing the button. The bottom of the phone, we do have all our proper cutouts. We have our mic, charging port, and speaker all perfectly aligned. It does not interfere with anything whatsoever, and you can charge via a cable with ease there. The case does not interfere with the cable at all and you do have a substantial amount cut out or room around the charging port just in case you have a thicker cable. And there's nothing on the top of the phone and on the back of the case we do have that lip protection for the camera so you do have that lay on the table design so you're, nothing's gonna happen to the phone when you lay its back on a flat surface. So why is laying on his back? Uh, let's go ahead and take our wireless charger here and see if it wirelessly charges through the case. And it does, as you can see, it's wireless charging through the case, so no issues there. So this is the Unicorn Beetle style case. This is $12.99 with prime shipping. 
very very good slim profile very protected your phone is protected but this is going to give you the most pocketable experience when protecting your iphone 11 pro like 11 pro max or 11 with a case so now let's move on to the next case let's go ahead and take a look at the electro case here this is the unicorn beetle electro now this is a two-piece case here and then as you can see you got that shiny chrome bumper all around the case there now you do have a soft tpu all around the phone and you do have a hard plastic shell on front of the phone so this is a two-piece the hard plastic shell just goes over the front portion of the iPhone and you do have a built-in screen protector here so let's go ahead and remove the front portion of the case as you can see very easily removable and as I mentioned earlier soft TPU all the way around and you do have that hard plastic shell with that built-in screen protector now this one's going to run you $16.99 with prime shipping but what you want to do is go ahead and place the plastic over the phone itself like this and then we're just going to insert it into the case and you just got to massage the case over the plastic shell there and let's go ahead the flashlight turned on okay and this is a very very snug fit here uh, it took a little bit of muscle to get it on there but we are on and as you can see it looks very very good you do have some subcase branding right there at the, the bottom right corner of the phone looks very very good soft tpu all the way around look at the raised lip there for your camera so you do have a substantial amount of lip protection there for the three cameras on the back and on the front you have that lip protection all the way around the front of the screen no issues there you can opt to remove the plastic screen protector if you want if you have one that you currently already have like the white stone dome you can leave it on it's up to you but either way they all work the same as you can see i do have the white stone dome on and it's still working with that one and the other one so no issues there whatsoever the buttons itself are covered these are a little bit harder to press uh, but you do get a nice tactile feeling very clicky and you they're very responsive you do get a satisfying feeling when pressing on the buttons both the volume and the power button but they're a little bit more firmer than the regular style unicorn beetle and this is a little bit more recess here so you might have a little bit of trouble here reaching for that uh mute slider there but the mute slider is all right it's not too bad as you can see i don't have a nail and i can still reach in there and turn the mute slider off and on bam no issues there but the cutouts on the bottom are all nice and precise you have your mic charging port and speaker all good uh, the buttons all on the sides are covered as I mentioned earlier nothing on top and on the back we do have that beautiful ring around the camera so you are protected now this is the sub case unicorn beetle electro case these will run you $16.99 with prime shipping now let's go and see if they charge wirelessly through the case and it does it charges wirelessly through the case no issues there bada bing bada bang boom so now let's move over to the big boy here the the unicorn beetle pro now this one will run you 19 dollars with 54 cents with prime shipping uh this does come with a belt holster so if you like to rock this belt belt holster on the side boom you can go ahead and do that and the belt clip here swivels 360 so you don't have no issues there so if you're that guy go ahead and drip hard my son so this is the unicorn beetle let's go ahead and remove this electro case and as you can see you do have a indentation there so you can peel back the soft tpu portion of the electro case and then you just pop out the phone no issues there removing the case is very simple and fast boom now we do have the unicorn beetle pro here case and now this 
case is a hard shell plastic on the outside. You do have this carbon fiber design on top and you do have this rubbery uh, texture TPU all around the edge. This is probably gonna give you maximum protection for your iPhones and you do have a built-in kickstand. Bam, 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 bam. So you can sit down and watch Gadget Beard YouTube videos during your break or lunch. Now this is also a two-piece case with the same indentation here. You do have the same little cutout here to peel back and separate the two pieces of the case. And you go bam and ugh, and it's separated. So this also has a built-in screen protector. Now you can punch it out if you want, if you already have a screen protector that you like. But for this video, we're not gonna do that. We're just gonna go ahead and place it over the front of the iPhone here. And as you can see, boom. So my phone is updating, damn. So let's just take a look at this portion of the case here. It, like I mentioned earlier, soft rubber TPU all around the edges and you do have that hard plastic shell. So what you wanna do is go ahead and place this inside like so and bam 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 just massage the rubbery case over the top portion of the case and voila look at that perfect fit very snug and boom now one thing to mention about this you do have a cover port for your charging port down on the bottom of the case so this have this little flap here cover that charging port which is cool you ain't gonna get no lint or anything like that and that's always a nice thing to have the cutouts for your mic and your speaker are perfectly aligned and no issues there now again with these the buttons are very covered but they're easily pressed, very nice and tactile. You do get a satisfying feeling when pressing down on the buttons with no issues there. The volume rocker as well, very nice and tactile, very responsive. And you do have a cover port for your slider mute button here. So we can pull the tab out and then you can just slide it. And as you can see, no issues there once the tab is pulled back. But let's go ahead and place that back, boom nice and covered now like i mentioned this is probably going to give you the most protection you can get for your iphone and as you can see bam look at that lip protection all around the camera so no issues there when you lay this phone on its back on a flat surface now look at that lip protection on the front as well all the way around the screen you get that very good lip protection and i do have a tempered glass screen protector currently installed the whitestone dome screen protector link will be in the description below if you want to go ahead and pick one of these up but i do have also the built-in screen protector for the unicorn beetle pro and you do still have this massive amount of lip protection all around the screen so you're definitely not gonna have to worry with this case if you lay your phone face down on a flat surface. Like I mentioned, this Unicorn Beetle Pro is probably gonna give you the most protection you can get when it comes to the subcase lineup. And uh, not to mention your holster there. So you're gonna also be styling and wilding out of control. So this is gonna give you the maximum protection here. Your Unicorn Beetle Pro, the Unicorn Beetle Electro is gonna give you some protection as well, but it's gonna keep it a little bit slimmer at a slimmer profile. And then you have the Unicorn the Unicorn Beetle style case here. This is probably gonna offer you the least protection, but still protecting your phone all three of these cases do a very good job at protecting it's just how how much protection you want you want minimal protection medium coverage or you want to go overboard and maximum protection right here like if you're Takashi 69 and you need gonna need that maximum protection once you get out of jail anyways uh, let's see if this this phone's almost done rebooting. So as soon as it's done rebooting, I'm gonna see if it wirelessly charges through this case and see if it's compatible with that. Let's go ahead and wait for this to update. I didn't know it was updating during the video. My apologies for that. Okay, so the iPhone is done updating. Let's go ahead and move these aside. Let's see if this Subcase Unicorn Beetle Pro phone charges wirelessly through the case. And it does charge through the case, which is 
awesome. So all three of these cases wirelessly charged through the case, no issues there whatsoever. Let's go ahead and put these back. So there you have it guys, the Unicorn Beetle Pro, the Unicorn Beetle Electro, and the Unicorn Beetle Style. All three of these uh, links will be in the description so you can go ahead and pick yourself up a case. But if you don't want to spend that money, just make sure you subscribe to the channel if you're new. Make sure you like the video and make sure you leave a comment in the section down below. And a lucky subscriber is going to go ahead and receive one of these cases for free. I am going to be giving away all my cases each time I do a case video review to a lucky subscriber. So go ahead and leave a comment down below. Subscribe and like. Thanks for watching guys. Please like, share, and subscribe. And like always, I'll catch you guys on the next video. Peace.